How would you feel, and I'm saying this to the audience, how would you feel if someone came up to you and said, hey, you're doing things wrong? How, what reaction would you have? Our field is littered with a bunch of different camps and different people that believe different things. And the thing is, we don't stop and just think about why does this person with so much shared passion, so many similar goals as I have, think so differently about the same thing? If you're like me, you struggle with what to listen to, what to deploy, what is the best tool to be able to help out the people that you serve. And in a way, you, you feel a little burnt that a $60,000 master's degree wasn't enough to actually equip you with the tools that you need. And look, you can blame the system or you can do something about it. The question that we explore today is when do you dismiss something that could actually affect the clients and the outcomes that you are there and employed to help them achieve. How would you feel, and I'm saying this to the audience, how would you feel if someone came up to you and said, hey, you're doing things wrong? How, what reaction would you have? And you would probably say, well, I went through this really great program. My professor said I should do it this way. I went through, I read these books and these other people were saying they're doing it. And oh, all my friends are doing it that way. All my colleagues are doing it that way. If someone said there's a better way to do it, the chances are you're going to be defensive right out of the gate. And I, we, did, we had a, a precision teaching conference not too long ago and there was a panel and one person stood up and said to the, this panel that was talking about why are more people adopting precision teaching? So well, why are you all so mean and, and telling us this is the only way to do things? And, my, and I, I should have stood up and said something because no one was being mean. Everyone was just saying, here's a better way. But this person was so offended, so attacked by the fact that because they were doing this way, they 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 took it as an attack in that. But it would be like if, if, if we were all medical professionals and one of you was putting your 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 head to the chest of someone else. And I said to you, hey, we have a stethoscope. Use this because you can detect those heartbeats better. You might immediately be attacked by that. You might not like it because it's not the way you're doing it. It's not the way everyone else is doing it, even though it's better to have a stethoscope and you'll have more accurate data. So that's what I see that's going on right now in our field. And you know, people will say things to make themselves feel better like like what you said dimitri earlier well you know those precision teachers they just want to do everything with rate or oh you know they say they should always do this and it's easy to dismiss that group because now you don't have to change personally and that's a hard pill to swallow to have spent all this time and all of a sudden for someone to tell you to change your measurement world and it's that dramatic so uh, I, I can appreciate people who are outside that don't have this knowledge. And, and I don't think that they're wrong because they didn't learn this in graduate school. They don't have the resources. And you know, just like what Skinner said, uh, the, the rat's always right, or as the, what we like to say, the learner's always right. So yeah. I get it and I can feel their pain. We want to hear your stories. How do you find the time to try to continue keeping up? Is there any strategies that have been successful? And how do you curb your emotions and set aside the fact that maybe you weren't burnt and like not adequately equipped with what you've put in so far? How do you move forward? I will see you in the comments. This episode is live and it's full podcast form. It's Sunday, the 27th. If you enjoy it, check out more clips here. Share, like, subscribe if you're into this. It actually makes a difference and that's your daily BA.